Hello and welcome FBL fans, I'm your host Joe Moore here and I'm bringing you week one of the FBL, new league, I've never been in it before, this is the first time I'm battling this guy here, Arts, uh, I'll try to have his YouTube uh, link in the description below, he is the coach of the PW, PWDS Finest, and of course he has his mascots there, he has Gyarados and Cinderace. And the six on the right is what I'm predicting he brings. Six on the left is what I am bringing. Uh, if you saw the draft recap, you know the whole team and why I drafted the way they did. <clears throat> but uh, let's see uh, how we connect here. And how this battle is going to go. Because it's going to be an interesting one. He has a lot of threats. Um, Spectrier, I don't believe should be a problem. I did bring a very uh, durable Scrafty for that thing. Uh, Cinderace could be a problem because uh, even that thing two shots a wheezing, <clears throat> and yeah, <laughs> it's it's scary. Uh, Gyarados is a little mm, a little easier to handle if he doesn't bring uh, Zygarde because then I'm unchecked with Thunderous. So this will. Be a very interesting and fun battle so once we get started all right we are officially synced up the battle is about to initiate again good luck have fun to arts and let's see if we can get our first win in this new league the new england chartriots versus pwds fine what is pwds i do not know all right, so this is the team he brings. Uh, Spectrier. Okay, let me go ahead and switch these things around. He does bring Chansey. He doesn't bring Drapion, which is kind of sucky. I was hoping not to deal with it. I mean, hoping to work that instead. But it makes sense why he didn't bring it. He didn't bring Rotom either. He does bring the Weezing, which is unexpected. But we should be fine either way. So what I'm going to do here is get rid of those things. And I'm not sure what I want to lead. I think I'm going to lead uh, Kitten Claw. Uh, we are Scarfed. So we'll get initiative on everything. And see what he does decide to do here. I do hope to get webs up in time to take out some threats that are just faster. And we will see how this battle goes. Okay. Oh, gosh. Done. Good luck. Have fun, Arts, once again. And let's get into this battle. He's wearing the crown. He is ready. He comes out blouse. What could that be? It is Cinderace. So now I'm going to build a scarf. Do I? Um, I'm tempted. I'm going to go ahead. Because there's nothing really I could switch in to take the hit. So he, he now knows we are scarf. But it is good. So let's go ahead and go to Putin. Our reason. Our shiny reason. First shiny I've ever gotten. This thing has a very good story in my heart. And Pyro Ball comes off. That's going to be big. Ooh, a really big chunk. I think that might be Bandit or Adamant. Uh. Not too bad if we go down here. He doesn't have Zygarde, which is good for us. So Weezy's gonna go down. Wasn't able to tank it as much as I was hoping, because obviously that is probably dangerous. 
judging from the damage output that gave us. So I'm gonna go back to Kitten Claw. Kitten Claw. And I am going to Volt Switch once again. He might go to Chansey here, but that is fine. He might try to preserve the Cinderace. And he does. Shiny Shirt. Oh wait, he does have the Zygarde. Oh, I messed up. I done messed up. Okay, so that was a misplay on our part. I'm gonna go to Sharknado here. Oh man, what a way to start week one. Sharknado is Dragonberry, so we will be able to live uh, one hit. Uninvested. Uninvested. Oh, so he withdraws. So jaded. Alright, that's actually fine. Oh, compared to what could have happened. I didn't see Levitate. Doesn't show Levitate. Alright, so... I'm gonna go to Chamber Bell. And this is my opportunity to get webs on the field. He might defog. He might have defog, but that's fine. At least I can try to attempt to get the off on the field. Strange thing goes off from the Tinker Bell. We tank that. And now we're gonna go sticky webs and see what he decides to do here. He goes toxic spike, which I'm not too worried about. So now I'm going to go Psychic. You know how hard that hits? Very good. He gets Debug off once again. I'm going to pick you up again. If we go down, we go down. Oh, he's going to get more. Uh, oh, wait, no. He got rid of the Spikes as well. So that benefits us at the same time. I'm just going to go for the Sticky Web once again. Because I don't think I'll be able to get it off against anything else. Because you know Cinderace comes in if I knock this thing out. So we will for sure have sticky webs as soon as the zombie goes down. Jaded comes out. Kiwi. Okay, Reggie still comes in. Can we get our sticky webs off? Alright, so what does he decide to do here? I'm gonna go back to Sharknado. He might iron the thing. We are playing very fast right now. <laughs> to say the least. Okay, so he is going iron defense. And this is where we're gonna sword dance. To try to stay even with it. And again, there is no Dynamax in this league, so that's not going to help us. Body press. Does it do over half? It does just over half. We do get rough skin damage off, though. Garchomp, as much as I would like for it to sweep, is not necessary. So let's go ahead and get this face off. And yeah, that plus two defense is leaving us here. And I think body press does a set amount of damage each time, so that's going that's gonna bring us down. So we lose a threat early. Um let's see. I'm gonna go Kitten Claws here, and I'm gonna Dark Pulse. He probably brings in the Zygarde. Again, I don't know which one. 
is actually in isn't in. So he's in Cinderace. Oh, Gyarados is in it. Alright, so we don't have to worry about Gyarados. That's the Pokemon. And Garchomp goes down. Dark Pulse does not much. So you that. So it is a very bulky, bulky Zygarde. Right, we're gonna go back to Tinkerbell. He still has his six Pokemon. Very fat team. Very, very fat team. We're gonna go back to Tinker, but he probably takes us out here. Uh, Thousand Arrows is resisted, but we are frail. Ooh, but we live! We live. Beautiful. Alright, let's go ahead. I don't know if I should Moonblast or Toxic. I'm not sure which one I want to do. I think I'm gonna talk. I think it'll work better in the long game. Yeah, I'm gonna talk. Might be in this play. The shield is coming in. Oh, beautiful. Toxic on that. We are down four to six right now. I'm gonna go Iggy. It's our best answer to this thing. I'm sure it's natural cure, so the toxic probably won't matter too much. But Iggy is here. Size will come to the off. We're gonna left over here. He gets some good damage off on Kishimi, and I'm gonna drag him down. Yeah. Dragon Dance comes off. Did he get toxic here, or did he get some of the size of stuff? Teleport, okay. We should outspeed everything now that we're plus one. Except maybe the spec carrier, but I'm not too worried about that. Because I don't see what spec carrier does to us. Nerd Delta. Alright, speak to web, moment of truth. Are we faster here so we don't have to deal with will o -Wisp? And even if he is, we are uh, shed skin. So shed skin. Ooh, it does a lot, but not enough. And Nerd Sosa goes down. Oh, it's Choice Guard. That makes sense. Well, now we no longer deal with that thing. Still wondering if we're going to be faster than Cinder Age, but... And of course, Zygarde's still very bulky. Weezing uh, is low on health. We should be able to knock that out with a knockoff. Reggie Steel is in his strength punch range. Anti would just give us health, so I don't know if that's smart for him to go into. 
So I just don't know if Cinders comes in or goes faster. If we're not, I mean, it's just not good for us, but we gotta stay in here and make the play. So let's make the play. Drain Punch, let's get some health back. Sucker Punch. Does that knock us out? It doesn't. So Drain Punch for the health. Beautiful. So he must have been like adamant. Uh, probably not max speed. So oh, yeah. So Cinderace goes down. Nice and resisted. So what does he have to go to now? If he goes Zygarde here, we're ice punching the shit out of that thing. Right, so Zabie comes in. I don't know what does the most. This is going to be my first count of the game. And... Iggy. Iggy to me. Crafty. Dragon Ball. Thirty eight to forty four. Oh, wait, that's the regular reason. Gala. Oh, what about Ice? We don't knock out here. I'm just gonna click Ice Punch. Nothing. Yeah, Strange Team's gonna take us out. But Iggy did what he was supposed to do. That's fine. Sorry about the wait. Sorry about the wait, but I wasn't sure what to do there. Alright, so we're gonna go to uh, Jirachi here. And we're gonna go for the flash camera. We're a max defensive, uh, max HP. This should knock it out though. Squeezing is pretty low on uh, special defense. So now we are at 3v3. And Shimmy comes in. Revealing that I have toxic. What does it decide to do here? Try to stop. going to go for a flash cannon just need to get some damage off on this thing. I think he switches you. I would think he switches you. I think he switches here. I'm going to go for the top two. Oh, he does not switch. That's not foil. Alright, fair play. Poison damage is still going to rack up though, and that gives him a, a free turn of healing. going to 
probably start some concept here. Hit and frog comes in. You get teleport. Oh, okay. Nice. Play. I'm sure. Or break. He gets so fast. Yeah, that chance is just so fat. It's just so fat. I should have went to um, Jirachi on the losing play, so I still had my my uh, my scrappy. Looking back, we might just lose the whole chance. Really? Not the whole, really, but it's you know, annoying chance. <laughs> So he substitutes you. Gonna be a problem. Cause that's Oh, that's bulky. Um we do a flash cannon because it's dead. Doubt we Doubt we break the sub, and we'll probably go down. A thousand arrows. Yeah. Alright, so I think we just lost the game there. Uh, letting Scrappy go down was probably a possible. I should have thought Jirachi on the losing. Don't know why I didn't. I, oh, yeah, I was playing <laughs> That explains it. Um. Go Tinkerbell. I feel like it was a good fight effort. But evidently, Zygarde was too tough. This is the exact team I prepped against, too, and I knew that Fat Chansey was going to be a problem. Reggie Steel. And I couldn't break the score, so GG. The PWDS But at least we didn't lose to a Cinderace or a Scarabin. <laughs> Let's go ahead and play off the rest of this battle. And it's all down to Kitten Claw. I mean, even if I somehow pinch this thing to death. Uh, Chansey's not gonna break. Yeah, no flinch either. That was an arrow just so broken. Oh man. But again, GG, Hearts, it was a hell of a battle. Uh, realized what I was doing too late. Uh, panic on scrapping in front of Weezer, threw him away, and caused me to gain. Because I feel Scrappy could have came in later, naturally faster than Zygarde could have ice punch. Uh, set up again in front of uh, Chansey, got some health back again. Ready still is already on the flat leg. Oh, yeah, no flinches. Not enough. <laughs> Wasn't gonna happen. GG, guys, and I will see you guys. Don't forget to check out Arch's channel.